what's up guys welcome back to another fortnite video we've officially entered fortnite season 9's first official update version 9.01 um it hasn't been a crazy crazy update because this is not one of the hard updates usually you get a hard update then you get a soft update we have the brand new tactical assault rifle which is now available and which we're going to be using in this video of course just in case you guys are wondering there has been some changes to certain weapons in the game for instance the p90 the compact smg has been bolted it's a little bit strange for me just because we literally just now have one smg in the entire game i mean i think it's just the regular smg right i don't think there's another smg unless i'm blowing like the biggest brain fart right now and i don't remember but i think the reason behind this is because although we have a brand new tactical assault rifle supposedly the tactical assault rifle might just be like a close range type of weapon but I still don't know why we have one SMG. The P90 has been vaulted and the jump gun has been nerfed. It's been nerfed to the fact where only the damage has been reduced. I think that it will receive another nerf. Um, it might not, but I'm leaning towards probably because I still think that this weapon is going to be still very very effective pretty much what's been changed in the drum gun is just the damage the base damage it used to be 26 27 and now it's all the way down to 22 23 it doesn't sound like a lot but sometimes those little minute changes do fix the gun uh, but of course we'll have to play with it or get destroyed by it for a couple more days to see if it really made a difference um also last thing for those of you that love getting into ballers and just riding around and causing havoc all over the place normally the ballers health is 200 and now it's been reduced to 150 so just be careful with the ballers because they're going to get destroyed slightly quicker now i honestly think that from 200 to 150 you could probably notice the change so don't go around causing too much havoc now i know hollow why the hell are you playing team rumble right now man really listen man when it comes to a new weapon i found out the hard way that it's easier to do this mode because if i find a gun i don't have to worry about dying i mean the only thing you have to worry about in this video as a youtube content creator is bringing tons and tons of gameplay with a certain weapon so what i'm trying to do here is find the weapon and as soon as i have it i have no worries in the world i can literally just start killing or eliminating people let's try and keep it rated pg here if you do like a regular solo or duo you die you're done sometimes finding weapons in this game takes longer than it takes you to actually play with it so for a skin I, i'll do everything else but when it comes to weapons i feel like just maybe you know taking it a little bit easier and playing some team rumble won't harm anybody besides it's literally five o'clock in the morning right now so <laughs> give me a break all right <laughs> so as soon as we get this new weapon it's on boys it is on like donkey kong hopefully it's not a bad weapon man i i, I don't know how i feel about it i'm just hoping that it doesn't suck and when i mean it doesn't suck i'm hoping that it's not bad in the sense that one you can use it because the damage is horrible and two that is not too op so i I'm, i guess you can say i hope that it's a balanced weapon and there it is look at that see what a great start this has been you play this mode you find a lot of good weapons the game just gives you weapons how does this sound wait what that's actually very slow. I mean, I'm not complaining. I promise you. I, I actually think that's better. I'm actually happy that there, there, there's not even a scope to actually aim through. I thought it was going to be kind of like the scope they are. And I was a little scared. I was a little worried. I'm like, I don't know, man. The scope they are is kind of garbage. But yeah, I think um, it was just an aesthetics thing to add the scope. Um, at the end of the day, it is literally just a John Wick weapon from the movie. So, And look at here. Do you see what I'm talking about, bro? This is the mode to go to, man. I also heard the Team Rumble has been uh, increased or buffed, I guess you could say. Normally, the goal was 100 kills or eliminations, and now it's 150. So it's essentially double as long or almost double as long. So that allows me to get more action in one video. You know, sometimes you play a Team Rumble game mode for like a certain type of content, and then you get the weapon or whatever it is you're looking for. And then it's slightly too late, and you don't have enough you know action in that game and it really kind of becomes useless i really also feel like team rumble is a mode where you can come if you don't have like a partner to go in creative in um it's literally a mode that you can come and just practice man because you kill and just keep respawning it's pretty much what you're doing creative and that's why people that spam creative practice are so freaking good because they they get so much practice as opposed to somebody that plays the duels or solos where there really isn't a whole lot of practice going on because once you die you're dead you got to go back to the main lobby and then you're all, you know, cool down after a couple minutes of waiting to get into another game, so. 
I don't know, man. That's my opinion. That's a blue AR. That's kind of hard to just leave there like that. But here we go. All right, let's see how this works out, boys. Oh, damn, we got fucking sniped. Okay, well, they stole my kill, but not gonna lie, that was actually not half bad. Wow. Okay. The gun's not bad, dude. Hold on. I need to get out of here. For the sake of this weapon, I'm going to use it here. I'm getting nothing but a bunch of hit markers and getting a bunch of damage done, but it doesn't seem to be finishing the job right now. All right, hold on. Heal up, heal up. It's okay. Yep. Team Rumble's a little crazy. I like this. Nice. Okay, the spam is real. Oh, dude, this is nice. Oh, this is real nice. I really like that it's not actually a scope they are. How's the damage from far? Oh, it's kind of trash. It's actually kind of like what Fortnite said. They said that it was going to be a weapon better up close. And it it's kind of weirdly better up close than from far. Which is kind of odd. Considering that it is an assault rifle. I don't know if doing such low damage balances the weapon out. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> Dude, what the hell? It's actually better from close. Feels like a hybrid between an SMG and an assault rifle. I like it so far. I mean, I do have a legendary right now. <laughs> Third of the way in the, into the game. We got some good action going on here. Team Rumble's been a little bit sweatier than lately. Uh, but that's because a lot of people are getting better at it. So that's not a bad thing. That just means better practice. Oh, snap. He's right there. Damn, man, everybody's stealing my shit. Dude, this gun is surprisingly good. Surprisingly satisfying. There's somebody with a freaking... It's this fucking little bird. Where's this guy? Right here. No little shit bird. Come here. Oh, no, we're out of bullets. Oh, dude. All right, let me reload. Dude, this gun is freaking good. All right. Up close and personal. Almost got slaughtered. Dude. So we're going to go back up through here. Oh, look at this guy. <laughs> Just a dude sitting there with a damn shotgun. What are you doing, my mans? Ah, dude, I don't want to brag, but the weapon's not bad at all. I'm going to go back in here and take this last big shield that I have. It's kind of odd because because it takes light bullets, um, the fire rate doesn't really seem that fast for, like, taking light bullets. But what affects it the most is just the damage. From, like, a medium to long range, it's not that effective. But when you're semi-close, it's pretty effective. And what makes it feel really good is just the fact that you can aim it really easily. It doesn't have a whole lot of... Uh, the bird again it's the bird again i like the gun so far it's pretty good until people start exploiting it online and this weapon can do that and this weapon could do this and then it's like all right 
Freaking screw this gun. There we go. Dude, the recoil is like... The recoil is almost like non-existent. It's kind of crazy. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. I think it's a pretty fair weapon. The only good thing is that if you have a decent range between you and your enemy, the damage is fairly positive. I don't know if I'd take the blue. Maybe I'd probably stick to getting like the purple or, or legendary that I had here. Maybe that's probably why I was enjoying it so much. I didn't really get to play much with the blue itself. Uh, but definitely a lot better than I expected. And again, it has a scope on top simply just so it can fit the theme of John Wick, not because it's actually a scope they are or whatnot. It was a point where I thought they were going to vote the scope they are because this was coming because obviously on top it's got a scope. But that's not even the reason why it has a scope. It's just it's literally just aesthetics. I know it's only one gameplay. It's a little short, but I just wanted to get this video out there so you guys can see the weapon. Let me know what you think about this weapon. If you like it. Let me know in the comments. Leave it a like. That would really be appreciated. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you later.